Okay, hey guys. So, Evolution just released patch 1.10 on January the 19th? January the 19th, 2015. And what it adds is a bunch of new features and the new Japanese tracks, which is free. You don't have to pay for that. Uh, right off the bat, we can tell they added the Drive Club store that you can access right away. And in multiplayer, there's, well, I can't really see it here, but they did add multiplayer time trial. Uh, what I'm going to be doing in this video is going through the five new tracks for Japan. I'll be doing each track in five different videos. Um, but first, I'm just going to go through a little bit of the, the patches, the changes in the patches that they made. Reading off the Evolution site, it says that there's improvements to the weather visuals so we can see rainbows and heat haze. Not sure if we're going to see that, but hopefully we'll get to capture a few of those. Um, changes in drift mode, making it easier to back up the score or whatever. Uh, AI drafting behaviors to change so that, I don't know, don't really play with AI. Um, changes in the to the impact of collisions, so it reduces the amount of drag and speed that's lost, which is a nice addition. Um, windscreen wiper shoots, uh, speed wiper speeds have been changed um, that's going to be a little hard to tell but I guess they're doing it all to make it look more realistic um, disables overscan compensation during remote play uh, 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 let's see photo mode we can reset the damage and remove dirt and then you can permanently hide the camera controls movement controls um, for those with the steering wheel, you can access photo mode now. And there's support for the new cars and stuff that's coming out the following week. So I'm going to get into it. Now, I tried making a video earlier and it kind of just like screwed everything up. But, right. So I'm just going to go through the first track. There are five different tracks and there's variants in each of them so in total there's 11 and I'll go through what I'm gonna do is go through one of them I'm gonna go through the, uh, the first track I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna go through it driving straight straight up driving uh, outside of the car view and then the second time I do it, I'm gonna play around with it so I'm gonna get straight to it without you know without uh, messing around too much I'm gonna leave it dynamic I'll leave this Clear? I'll leave it clear. Time compensation, da, 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 no compensation, compression. Start at 2. I think 2 should be okay. Start playing. Um, start with the Ferrari. Factory, good job. Green way we can see it's a lot of colors. Heck of a lot of colors. And yeah. And it looks good. So I'm just going to play through this track normally without uh, messing around with photo mode or anything. Still trying to get used to all these controls. It's been a while since I've played this. when I come back the next time. Uh, I'm kind of tempted to pass that car in the time trial. Hope that I can keep it up. Start to see the screen 
screen is covered, covered with rain. Now again, I'm just gonna leave this run clean. Oh shit, there we go, that's so cool. But um, yeah, I'm not gonna change the cameras or anything. So we could get a good look at the track as a first run. Anyway, so that's the first run. Um, if I didn't mention, which I probably didn't mention, this track is the Goshodara. Gosh, Gosh, Goshodara. Hopefully I pronounced that right. Um, we continue first. So I'm gonna do it the other variant since this is uh, a point to point. We'll have two different variants. Go back to Japan, turn back the other way. Um, Leave it clear, leave it dynamic, or leave everything the way it is because it seems to be fine. Uh, event settings, okay, that's fine. Go to play. I will choose. I'll just go with an Aston Martin this time. But have a... So, what I'm gonna do is, I'm um, might purpose I uh, will if I don't crash then I'll have to purposely crash just so that we can test out the damage changes. And right off the bat I really just wanna photo mode. Uh change the camera type, could roll around. So we could take a look at the trees. Funny thing is as you they roll with the camera. So you can't really actually like take a look at the trees kind of funny but that's how uh, developing is it's really is just making things look not as they appear but we have some leaves flying around anyways there's no damage so I will have to come back to this later and we'll just continue <laughs> I didn't realize I was already in cup, cup of view and I already crashed. So closer to the ending I'll do the next photo view, photo mode view, just because you know, uh, there is the other blossom trees, cherry blossom trees that I want to take a look at. Here I'm just going to keep going through. Oh, I'm not used to this handling of the last one. Don't mind me if I start spinning out and crashing one. It's weird driving on the, the right side. I love how the water moves as you turn, it just shifts. 
So there should I'll be doing one right here. Okay. So here it's a lot of rain. There's a bridge. It's people. I wonder if I could oh, how do I zoom out? Go oh, to. I can't really go above the bridge. Zoom in. Now what I want to take a look at is the damage. So I did crash a little. You can see some scuffs here and there. Some dents. Um what I'm gonna do is go with settings, card damage right now is on, and then here it is off. So that's pretty cool. Removes all that. The lighting changes probably because of all the damage. I don't know. Um, what I'm gonna do is rotate to somewhere where there is the sun because earlier I noticed something a little peculiar, but we'll see if we can see it here. Go back here, on and off. Because what it seems like to me is that the shadowing and everything changes just because it's a change in the actual car model. Um, so it just reverts to the actual like, design model and obviously it looks better for photo mode. Uh, let me get out of here. And um, yeah, it's just a different texture set. So it's actually we could take a better look if we zoom in here and we turn it on and off. Oh, cancel camera. There we go. Uh, it's a wheel that I notice it the most. Yeah. So there's like a different shine to the tire itself. But anyways, so let me finish this off. It is a very Anyways, so that's the first track, the first video of this set. Uh, I'll be going through the other tracks in the other videos, so keep an eye out for those. Uh, let me just continue. Yeah, it's not much. So I'm going to stop the video here, and hopefully I'll see you guys in... I'll see... Yeah, okay, I'm just going to shut up. <laughs>